Hey guys, I'm Rebecca, and I'm just saying, a lot of times when we feel lonely after a breakup is mostly due to the fact that we pretty much do everything with them. We've gone to the grocery store, we've gone to the movies, we've gone to theme parks, we've gone to family parties even. So, when the relationship is over, you're like, well, crap. Who am I going to do this with now? So it's not so much about the person as it is about the companionship and always having someone there with you doing something, you know. And what I've noticed is that in a lot of relationships, it seems that it it's just a habit. You know, it's not necessarily like, yeah, let me call babe and tell her we're going to go to the grocery store. You know, I need to get some toilet paper and cookies. You know, it's it's not that. It's, it just becomes a habit like, hey, babe. I'm gonna go to the grocery store and it's like, okay, I'll be ready. And you guys end up getting in, end up going together. So a lot of it is just the habit of having someone there for you all the time. And that's ultimately your choice. Because that's why they say, you know, in a relationship, it's important to have time for yourself to do those kinds of things so that, you know, if that person's ever not able to be around, you're still gonna be able to get things done. You know, so it's ultimately your choice to involve someone in everything that you do. Even It can even be a friend. It doesn't necessarily have to be a boyfriend, girlfriend, 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 boyfriend, boyfriend, whatever you choose. But it doesn't necessarily have to be a relationship. It's just anybody that you're always with all the time, you know, and then they're gone or you can't have them there with you. And then you just feel like this sense of loneliness or... It's not the same without them, and it's not necessarily that you guys had a great memory doing that all the time, but it's just that they were there, you know, because I've gone right after a breakup, I've gone somewhere, and I'm like, oh, I remember going with so-and-so here, but it's not necessarily, like, that it sucks. It's just I was used to having someone there with me, you know. But once you st once you start doing things on your own, it's it's cool because... I mean, for me, I love to go places alone. I love to go shopping alone. I love to go hiking alone. I love to do a lot of things alone because it's on my own terms. I don't have to wait around for anybody. I'm not responsible for anybody but myself. I can leave when I want to. I can do whatever, you know. I can talk to whoever, do whatever, and it's just that freedom that I love having, you know. And you can have that in a relationship, but that's that's when you guys got to start setting boundaries. Like, okay, I don't need to go with you every time you go to the store. Like, why? I just need to get some dang, I need to get some tampons. That's all I need. I don't need you to come with me. You know, if you want to hang out afterwards, we can. But that's how people start becoming so attached is because they're used to having someone with them all the time. And, you know, like I said when they're gone, if you guys break up, it's just you don't want to do that anymore or it's not the same and you start feeling different towards what it is because that person's not in it anymore, you know. That's all I'm just saying, you know, do your own thing. You can still have a relationship and have your own time. You don't always need to do everything together. If you enjoy that, then by all means, but if it just becomes more of like a habit and a routine, like, oh, I have to go because my boyfriend wants to go here, or my girlfriend wants to go here, you know, go because you want to go, you know. Don't force yourself to go. Don't make someone go with you. You know, it's nice to have that companionship, but it's also nice to be able to do things on your own time, on your own terms. And that's all I'm just saying. Do your thing. Let people do their thing. There's no need to get attached and, you know, you get, you get a lot more done that way, too. That's all I'm just saying. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll have a video for you guys next Monday. I found time to do a video, so I'm very happy about that. This just became a habit. I had to make time to do this video. These videos are just my babies now. So I hope, you know, that whoever's watching just... I really do appreciate it. I do. I'm just... I'm just saying. Thanks, guys.